Hey, what's up, Vancouver? This is Chris Krug. I'm checking in here just after lunch at Fuel. I'm here with Janet Moore of City Studio. How's it going, Janet? It's great. Awesome. Say hi to the internet. Hi, internet. We're here. I'm standing in the City Studio Student Gallery, which we'll get to in a second. But Janet and I were just having lunch, and she was telling me a little bit about City Studio. It was something unfamiliar to me and sounds totally awesome. So tell us a little bit about what you got going on in City Studio. So City Studio is a collaboration of the six public post-secondary schools in the city of Vancouver and basically it's an innovation hub inside City Hall where students and city staff and community members co-create projects and get them on the ground. That's so cool. Almost like a Silicon Valley textile incubator inside really? municipal government. Yeah. yeah. What do you want? How, what do, how do we work together to build the cities we want to live in? Yeah. So this is a space where students' ideas get mixed up with city ideas, get mixed up with community, and we put them on the ground. So let me get this straight. You're letting students do projects. That's right. <laughs> We've got a lot of ideas in the city. We always have a lot of ideas, but we actually want them to implement, yeah. put it on the ground. And so the city's really working with us to sort of relax some of those boundaries and like try something out, an experimental trial or a reversible trial. Sure, like you're saying, like many architects graduate school without ever having built something, which yeah. is kind of laughable. And so instead, you guys are doing what? Yeah, next week we're starting a class. Dwayne Elbrum is teaching. He's the co-director. He's teaching a, a, a three-credit course with the architecture students, and they're going to be building community gardens and community garden sheds all over Vancouver. This is so cool. So this is like undergrad students, they're enrolled in one of the major six institutions, and then it comes like practicum, co-op time, and they can come get placed inside city studios and work on something. Yeah in conjunction with city planners that's real deal and yeah. gonna benefit their community. We have we have a couple of programs. One is the interdisciplinary interinstitutional core studio program. We also have a partner network. So basically you can as a faculty member come and get hooked up with the city staff and also transform your course that way. So it's actually much bigger than just the studio. Awesome. So if I'm a young person interested, I'm going to school right currently yeah. enrolled in school, how do I get involved? Check out CityStudioVancouver.com. Cool and just apply and yeah. Good projects yeah. get included, and you guys even give away yeah. some money. I was having you were announced a grant at lunch there or something. Yeah, well, they get they start to understand funding in the city and networks, and their students get start to get engaged, and they see all of the possibilities. So some of our students just today are um, waiting to hear about their neighborhood grants and uh, get their projects on the ground this summer. Tell me about one of these cool projects we got on the go behind me here. So we have um, a couple different projects today. We have a food share project, which is actually was piloted this spring, where the students took um, dairy, like milk crates, put them into businesses along Commercial Drive, and instead of those grocers putting gar um, like an apple that's bruised into the composter, they put it into the bin, and one of the community centers came by and picked up those um, bins and helped feed young people in the community center. Awesome. So they were all like, "There's food going to waste. How do we take that?" And, and distribute it. Though. Yeah, it's kind of balancing that whole supply and demand equation. Pent up demand in the system yeah. trying to be redirected towards folks yeah. that need it. Awesome. And good work. All good. Great to meet Thanks, you, Janet. Chris. Thanks for doing a little interview with me. We'll check in with some more folks <laughs> later. We've been experiencing a little technical difficulties. I lost a Joel Solomon interview earlier, which is killing me. <laughs> but uh, when you're winging it, that's yeah. kind of what happens sometimes. Right. So nice over and out to. for now, internet. Bye. Bye.